time now for a walk-off interview brought to you by the Larry H. Miller dealerships. Driven by you, we take it downstairs. Here's Holly. Well, Mike Conley, I, I, I'm not sure if I've seen a 15-year vet diving on the floor for loose balls like you were tonight. Why did you want this win so badly here at home? Oh, man, um, you know what we've been going through as a team. Uh, a lot of people doubting us right now, but, you know, in that locker room tonight, it was just about being together uh, through adversity, see what we're made of in this adverse time. And, you know, I want to win more than anybody in the world, so it's better to do it, home, better to do it at home than anywhere. Mike, we've seen your desire to win. You have been carrying the load through this really difficult stretch without so many people. How have you been able to be such a leader, not only with your play on the court, but trying to keep everybody together with this young group that's getting a lot of playing time? Oh, man. Luckily, I've been in the league so long. Uh, I've seen a lot of different teams. I've been on teams with 28, 29 different teammates through, through a year, so I know what it's like to kind of go through different lineup changes like we've been through. And, um, just trying to keep everybody focused on the, the ultimate goal at hand that we're trying to be a championship team and and these moments right now are going to make us uh, You know better down the road. So I've just been trying to stay in everybody's ear uh, Try to help everybody with the plays learn the plays learn how to play together and and do what I can on uh, offense and defense You have gotten so many contributors that are improving Trent Forrest tonight another career high eight assists No turnovers. How are these young guns really developing in this time of adversity? Uh, I think this is an important time as ever for them. Uh, the confidence that they're building right now, the, the, the moments they're getting to have in big games, in national televised games, for them to come out and play as hard as they did. Um, JB, Trent, Doak, I mean, Eli, you go down the line, all these guys who've been sitting and watching uh, for a year, some a year and a half. I'm just proud of the way they've come out and, uh, and accepted their role. And hopefully we just continue to, to build. I know Joe Ingles is in the building. How much does this mean to win this for him when he can't be out here with you tonight? Oh, uh, Joe, <laughs> Joe knows how much we, we wanted to win for him. Um, it's just a sad thing for him. You know, he, he means so much to our team, and his presence alone is enough to, to get us going through a day. So, um, you know, hopefully, uh, I know Joe's back there right now probably cursing me out, of, you know, for missing a layup or something that, you know, down the stretch. So I'm going to go talk to him. Uh, but we're happy to get the win. Thanks so much, Mike. Great fight tonight. All right. Thank you.